Guys, uh, smartphones haven't really evolved. They've just become more expensive. People pay more for small upgrades. Now imagine a phone focused on integration, connecting your car, energy, and connectivity at an affordable price. That's not just a phone. That's a shift in thinking. Guys, very soon, people in the US might start saying bye-bye to the iPhone. Because honestly, the conversation around the Tesla Pi phone is getting louder across America. From tech forums to everyday users, one question keeps coming up. Are smartphones finally due for a real change? Phones in the US now cost more than ever, yet many buyers feel underwhelmed just weeks after purchase. Battery concerns, fragile designs, and premium prices, they don't always match the experience anymore. That's why the idea of a Tesla phone is getting attention, not as hype, but as a real possibility. If Tesla ever builds a phone, it won't be about winning spec wars, it would be about integration. And quick reminder, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit subscribe and tap the bell icon for real tech analysis, not quickbait. Now, some tech reports and online discussions also suggest that the price could be around $179, which is one big reason this phone is getting so much attention. So why would Tesla enter the phone market at all? Well, because Tesla doesn't sell standalone devices. They build ecosystems, cars, energy, software, and connectivity. A phone would simply become the remote control for that entire system. A lot of people expect free satellite internet everywhere, but the realistic approach would be hybrid, 5G for daily use in cities, and satellite connectivity only when it actually matters, like road trips, rural areas, or emergencies. A good phone doesn't need to be flashy. It needs to feel right in the hand, sound clear on calls, and work reliably. But none of that matters without apps banking, messaging, navigation, they must work from day one. And then there's privacy. If a phone connects to your car and home systems, security and user control can't be optional. So here's the real question. Is America ready for a phone that's part of a connected lifestyle and not just another screen? Share your thoughts in the comments. And if you want analysis before hype, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching.